Hey guys, Grady here with another episode of Grady's Garage. Today we're going to go over one of our biggest expenses, tires. Here's some tips on what to look for when you're doing your pre-trips. So one of the things we want to look for when we do our pre-trip is our tread depth and our tread condition. We want to get ourselves a good tread depth gauge so we can see just how thick the rubber is on the tire and we'll know exactly where we stand if the tread's good or not. It's worth the investment. So this tire here, we can see it's a pretty good tire. Looks fairly new. We're going to stick it with our tread depth gauge to see how thick the rubber is. Looks like this one's at 11.30 seconds. It's good to roll. Another thing to look for is discoloration in the sidewalls. If the tire's been run flat, we run the risk of blowing it out. The heat from running flat will actually weaken the sidewall, so we want to look for that. Wheel damage, we want to look for wheel damage. We want to check our lug nuts every time. We want to look for any chunks out of the tread, any chunks cuts, anything that looks irregular, irregular wear, anything. We need to go ahead and get that problem solved as soon as we can. We don't want it to blow out on the side of the road because then we double the cost of the tire, almost automatically. So the sooner we can handle the situation, the better, because we don't want to leave you stranded. So those are just a few of the things that we can go over on our pre-trip to prevent breakdowns and to keep DOT off of us a little bit. Tread depth, tire condition, and air pressure is the three things for the tire. Um, you cover those three things, you should be good to go. Thanks for stopping into another episode of Grady's Garage on Tire Wear. Check you next time.